everybody and welcome back to my channel. I know it has been a hot minute since I moved so it has been quite a while since I have been on my channel and I apologize for that. So if you are new here, hello and welcome. My name is Samantha. I do both health, beauty, fitness videos, all about confidence here on this channel, living a healthy lifestyle, looking pretty, all that kind of good stuff. So um, you guys are probably like, why do you look like such a bum right now? Um, sorry, I was adjusting my nose ring. And that is because I have been busy putting this house together. Last week I was back at work. So I apologize for not being around for the past two weeks, but now I'm back. And I put a poll on my Instagram and my Snapchat and nobody really responded to it. So I sat down and I thought, hmm, what do I want to record? Something that I can record now that I have my own house and I'm not living with my mother-in-law anymore. Something that I can do now that I have my own house and it came to mind this video of me showing you guys what is in my fridge so that is what we're gonna do um yeah so also if you are new here please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and the little bell as well and welcome to the sam fam that is what we are called here and we're all about loving and confidence so yeah, if you guys want to see what is in my fridge, all of the goodness that goes into this bad boy, then let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first thing that you're gonna notice whenever you come to my house is I have this new menu board. And it's just literally just a magnet. And I have some chalk markers that I put on there. And um, I will leave a link for that down below because I literally got this for like $10 on Amazon. And this is what our um, food is looking like for this week. So yeah, let me go ahead and open it. Up top, I just have some wine, some alcohol that I don't really drink, my Nutribullet, and then some plastic and paper cups from when we actually moved in. So that is up there. And then when you open it up, can you just take note? It's very, very full right now. All of it is very full. So I'm going to start on the door first. So up top here, we have um, Daisy's food. I have some Italian style pepperoni that I like to eat sometimes. This is a fruit jam. Chuck loves it. So um, that is for him. This is my probiotic. If you guys are ever wondering about a really good probiotic, this is really good. It has to be refrigerated. So I really enjoy that probi probiotic. It works really well for me. Um, then we have some milk. As you guys know, I don't drink milk, so that, of course, is for Chuck. Then we have, you know, condiments, cold brew, regular coffee creamer, again, for Chuck. And then I recently found this Brianna's um, Real French Vinaigrette Dressing. It's amazing. Um, also, something that I have a lot of are these Cindy's Kitchen um, dressings that you can get at Whole Foods. Sadly, I don't have one near me anymore, but... Yeah, these are amazing. I have the Asiago, I have blue cheese, I have the rosemary and roasted garlic and the chipotle ranch. Love them all. Then we have some mayo. I have some Sweet Baby Ray's honey mustard back there, which is something that Chuck and I could have gone the rest of our lives without knowing about because it's amazing. Um, I have some kombucha. I have some sesame garlic sauce because um, something to know for this is that it's gluten-free and a lot of like soy sauces and stuff are not gluten-free. Then we have some wing time back there. And then we have some Bailey's almond milk liqueur. This is actually unopened, but um, I have that in here just in case you know I get a little fancy on the weekend. Um, some margarita mix, because I can always get down with a good margarita. Um, some minced garlic, some maple syrup. Then down here we have some ginger beer, some marinades that I like from Wegmans. This is a lemon garlic one. And this is a cilantro lime. Um, I have some blue cheese, some um, spicy brown mustard, and then this stuff is amazing. It's a roasted garlic aioli from Stonewall Kitchen. It's actually got no sugar in it, which I really like. So that is the door. And then now we're getting into 
the top shelf. So I have almond milk. I have another one back there because this one's about to be out. A lot of these buy drinks, Chuck loves them, so they're in here for him. Back here, we have some um, fruit and nut mix from Sargento. Sorry for the noise of my fridge, by the way. I apologize for that. Um, then we have some probiotic drink. This is something that Chuck drinks. A bunch of hard-boiled eggs because Chuck loves hard-boiled eggs for lunch, so I do that for him. These are chicken tikka masala packets from um, Costco. They're really good. And then I have a homemade balsamic dressing back there. Next shelf, we have eggs. And you guys are like, holy crap, that's probably a lot of eggs. I actually go between, Chuck and I both go between four, and a, four to four and a half dozen eggs each week. So have me some eggs in there. And then we have some strawberries and raspberries here. And then, ooh, I'm gonna drop that back there. We have a raspberry sauce and some sour cream. Obviously the sour cream is for Chuck because I try and stay away from dairy. This is um, roasted red pepper hummus. I always have hummus on hand because I love eating it on toast. Then we have some of these organic pomegranate mango waters that Chuck really likes. And then we have some canned pickles. He likes bread and butter. I, however, am obsessed with dill. Okay. So now down here we have some rosé wine, yum yum, and then we have, what do we have back there? Oh, some Tocito salsa. Um, I have some cherry tomatoes, always have those on hand. This and then back there is homemade chicken noodle soup from Chuck's mom because he hasn't been feeling well for the past like four or five days. So this has noodles in it. Back there she removes the noodles because I am of course gluten free. So that is delicious. And then right here, I have marinated chicken for tonight's dinner, some more roasted red pepper hummus. I also have some bacon. And then back there is some yogurt that is sheep's and goat milk yogurt, which still messes with my stomach, so can't be eating that. Then I have some um, English cucumbers, some cherry tomatoes, part of a cut up tomato. And then some non bread, which Chuck really likes this with the chicken tikka, so I can't have that, but he can. Okay, and then in this drawer, we have some um, cheese. I have some deli meat from Wegmans. Um, they're organic um, ro honey roasted turkey breasts. It's the only one that I'll get because if you look close at the ingredients, the ingredients here, let me just put this down so I can show you. So the ingredients are literally organic turkey breast, water, organic honey, and salt. That is it. So really clean ingredients, there's no nitrates or whatever. And the same with the organic roast beef. Chuck really likes roast beef. We have all different kinds of cheeses for sandwiches and stuff. I have my lemons in there, which I don't know why. Um, and then string cheese. Chuck really likes these and string cheese for his lunches. So that is there for him. Then down here we have some Corona and Michelob Ultra. Again, you guys know I'm gluten free. That is not for me. Then here we have some asparagus, some romaine, some um, cut up romaine, I think. Um, some celery, carrots, mushrooms. And then in here I have two packets of this spring mix from Wegmans. Then we have down here, um, this is tzatziki sauce. Chuck really likes this with cucumbers, so I packed that for his lunch. And then we have two um, bell peppers. And then we also have um, broccoli and green, green, green beans. So yeah, that is what is in my fridge. I kind of went through that really quick. But there isn't really too, too much to my fridge i mean i try and keep it really healthy um especially now that we have our own house so yeah most of it is all healthy and everything so since i did the fridge kind of really quickly i'll show you guys my freezer um there's not really much in it but you guys can see it if you want to so if you want to see this then just keep watching so this is my freezer so I have some frozen bananas here and here. These ones are cut up. These are more so for like banana bread. Um, a whole chicken from Wegmans, or not Wegmans, Whole Foods. Um, here is just legit a whole rack of frozen fruit 
for my smoothies. And then down here we have ice cream, which, you know, YOLO. It's all about a lifestyle, guys. So ice cream once a week, not even for us is totally normal and okay. Um, I have some tilapia loins from Weg or from Costco. And then you'll see a lot of these like freezer pouches. And that is because um, I go to Costco in bulk and I come home and I divvy it all up and I end up freezing everything. So each Costco individual packet has three breasts in it. So I divvy them up to have two a piece for Chuck and I. Down here, I have some more frozen fruit. So I have up there, I have some um, frozen acai packets. Um, these are blueberries, these are frozen grapes. Um, I have two things of um, frozen turkey breast. Um, I guess Chuck's mom brought that over with her. Um, I just noticed that now. And then um, I have some gluten-free pumpkin spice waffles that I like to partake in every once in a while. And then down here, I have back there, um, some frozen ground beef, organic grass-fed ground beef from Costco again. Um, these are delicious Udi's Classic hamburger buns. They are gluten-free, so I have um, two packets of those. I also have some Dave's Bread for Chuck. And then in here is just um, that same ground turkey, just divvied up into half-pound pieces, so we don't need more than that. And then down here, this is just an ice pack for me. Um, some bacon here, Cuervo there, and then for Chuck, his ice packs. So, yeah guys, that is pretty much it as far as my fridge slash freezer goes. So, I mean, there's nothing really too intense with that. That is basically what that is. Um, if you guys want me to do a pantry um, haul, not haul, like if I, if you want to see what's in my pantry, then definitely give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. Um, I can definitely do that for you guys. I have no problem, but yeah, I just really want to do a fun short video, show you guys what I have in my fridge, what Chuck and I kind of eat on a daily basis. If you want to see what the week looks like, then just pay attention to that menu right there. It gets changed every week. And then as you can see, we have our engagement photos on Saturday. But yeah, that is basically it. I just really wanted to show you guys what's in my fridge. It'll change on a week by week basis because I go to the grocery store every single week. But yeah, um, I hope that you guys like the pieces of my kitchen that you see and our fridge. Um, but yeah. That is all that I have for today's video. If you guys liked it, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you are not already, again, subscribed and part of the Sam Fam, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to hit the bell for future notifications. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.